minutes and 37. Learn how to speak Korean source. How to do to Korean.com. Below is a list of Korean vocabulary with English meaning, pronunciation, common usages and examples. Nouns. 도로 equal road. Common usages. 고속도로. Highway. High speed road. 자전거 전용 도로. A road lane for bikes only. 일반 통행 도로. A one way road. 보행자 도로. A pedestrian road. Examples. 일반 도로가 피해를 입어서 고속도로가 막힐 것 같아요. The regular road was damaged so the highway will probably be blocked up. 이 도로를 따라서 쭉 걸어가면 병원이 나와요. If you walk straight down this road, you'll see the hospital. The hospital will come out. 고속도로 equal highway. Common usages. 고속도로 통행료. Toll fees on a highway. 고속도로 휴게소. Highway rest stop. Examples. 그 고속도로에서 트럭을 운전해서는 안 돼요. You must not drive a truck on that highway. 이 사거리를 지나면 고속도로가 시작돼요. If you go past this intersection, the highway starts. 고속도로가 막혀서 일반 길로 갈 거예요. I will take the normal road because the highway is blocked up. 한국에서 고속도로를 사용하면 고속도로 통행료를 내야 해요. In Korea, when you drive on the highway you must pay the toll fees. 고속도로에서 발생한 사고에 의해 사람들이 지나가지 못했어요. Due to the accident that occurred on the road, people couldn't pass. 스님 Buddhist monk Examples. 저는 스님께 돈을 드렸어요. I gave money to the monk. 스님을 보고 싶으면 절에 가야 해요. If you want to see a Buddhist monk, you need to go to a temple. 스님이 되고 싶으면 욕심을 다 버려야 돼요. If you want to become a Buddhist monk, you need to get rid of all of your greed. 공원에 스님이 있어서 우리는 술을 다른 곳에서 마셨어요. There was a monk in the park, so we drank our alcohol in another place. 당국 어소라티즈 이그젠펄즈 당국이 올 때까지 기다려 주시기 바랍니다. Please wait until the authorities come. 그 남자가 불법 행동을 하는 것을 봐서 저는 당국에 바로 말할 거예요. I saw that man do something illegal, an illegal act, so I will tell the authorities immediately. 이 일에 관련이 있는 당국은 오늘 안에 일을 꼭 처리해야 돼요. The authorities that are related to this case should deal with it by today. 도시락 Lunchbox Notes Lunchboxes are usually different in Korea compared to the West. Nevertheless, the food one brings to work, school or some event to eat later is usually referred to a 도시락 It doesn't necessarily need to be for lunch, but the translation is usually a lunchbox. Common usages 도시락 반찬 Lunchbox side dishes 도시락을 싸다 To pack a lunchbox Examples 제가 어렸을 때는 엄마가 매일 도시락을 사 주었어요. When I was young, my mom packed a lunch box for me every day. 아침에 엄마가 사준 도시락을 깜빡하고 안 가져왔어요. I forgot to bring the lunch box that my mom packed for me in the morning. 도시락을 안 가져와서 점심을 못 먹을 거예요. I won't be able to eat lunch because I didn't bring my lunch box. 저번 주에 동물원에 가려고 했지만 내가 갑자기 감기에 걸려서 갈수 없었다. 엄마는 나와 아빠를 위해 도시락을 만들어서 점심으로 그 도시락을 먹을 거다. We tried to go to the zoo last week, but because I suddenly caught a cold, we couldn't go. Mom made a lunch box for Dad and I, so we will eat that for lunch. 여행자, 트래블러 Common usages 배낭여행자, 백퍼커 이그잼펄즈 유럽에는 전 세계에서 온 배낭 여행자들이 많아요. There are a lot of backpackers from around the world in Europe. 여기에 여행자가 너무 많아서 다른 곳으로 갈 거예요. I'm going to go to a different place because there are too many travelers here. 피해, 데미지. Common usages. 피해자, 빅팀 피해를 입다. To get damaged. 금정적인 피해. Financial damage. 인명 피해. Damage to human life, casualties. 으로 인한 피해. Damage due to, examples. 우리 집이 홍수로 피해를 입어서 집에 못 들어가요. We can't go into our house because it was damaged by the flood. 일반 도로가 피해가 입어서 고속도로가 막힐 것 같아요. 
The regular road was damaged, so the highway will probably be blocked up. 시민들이 홍수로 인한 피해를 입은 길을 복구하고 있다. The citizens are restoring the street that was damaged by the flood. 이번 홍수로 인해 한국에 심각한 금전적인 피해가 있었어요. There was serious financial damage in Korea due to this flood. 성형 Plastic surgery Notes 성형 Itself refers to plastic surgery, but it is usually combined with another word. When referring to the surgery itself, it is common to say 성형 수술 Common usages 성형 수술을 받다 To get plastic surgery 성형외과 의사 A plastic surgeon Examples 저는 너무 못생겨서 성형 수술을 받고 싶어요. I want to get plastic surgery because I am so ugly. 점점 많은 사람들이 성형 수술에 관심을 갖기 시작했어요. More and more people are starting to get interested in plastic surgery. 그 연예인이 성형 수술을 많이 받아서 옛날과 아주 달라 보여요. That celebrity looks very different than before because she got a lot of plastic surgery. 연휴 Continuous holidays Notes. One day holidays in Korea can fall in the middle of the week, in which case they are not considered. Yanhu. However, it is possible that a one day holiday aligns up with a weekend, in which case it would create a long weekend. In these cases, it can be called up. Yanhu. The Hanja characters for Yanhu. Mean connected and holiday break, respectively. Common usages. Chuseok Yanhu. Choose the holiday, three day holiday in the fall around Thanksgiving. Solarianhu. Seonal holiday, three day holiday in the winter. Hangumianhu. When. Chuseok. Or. Solar. Line up with weekends to create an extended holiday. Examples. This weekend is a long weekend, so I will go to our mom's house. 내년 추석은 일주일 내내 쉴수 있는 황금연 휴예요. Next year, Chuseok will be a holiday where we can rest for a week. 이번 주말이 연휴라서 특별한 계획이 있나요? This weekend is a long weekend, so do you have any special plans? 최신 The latest notes 최신 is a noun but is usually placed before another noun to describe it like an adjective. Common usages 최신 유행 Latest trend. 최신 기술. Latest technology. 최신 음악. Latest music. 최신 핸드폰. Latest cell phones. Examples. 그것이 최신 정보여서 맞는 것 같아요. That is the latest, most up-to-date information, so it is probably right. 최신 핸드폰이 아니라서 이 앱이 아주 느려요. This isn't the latest cell phone, so the app is really slow. 많은 사람들이 최신 아이폰이 출시되는 첫날에 핸드폰을 사기 위해서 새벽부터 기다렸어요. Many people wait from early in the morning to buy the latest cell phones on the day that they are released. 진심 Sincerity, truth, common usages. 진심으로, 신실리 진심이야, 릴리 이그젠펄즈, 저는 진심으로 제 남편을 세상에서 가장 사랑해요. I sincerely love my husband the most in the world. 지혜는 진심을 다해 남자친구를 사랑했지만 남자친구는 지혜와 헤어지고 싶었어요. Jihye really sincerely loves her boyfriend, but her boyfriend wants to break up with her. 저는 우리 딸을 진심으로 사랑해서 그녀를 위해 모든 것을 할 거예요. I will do everything for my daughter because I truly love her, love her from the bottom of my heart. 한편 On the other hand 한편 Has different usages in its most simple usage, it can be used to indicate the same side or same direction. For example, 너랑 나는 항상 한 편이야. You and I are always on the same side. It is also possible to be used to mean on the other hand. When used like this, there are usually two clauses that oppose each other connected by some grammatical principle that means although, in this usage, 으로. it is commonly attached to 한 편. For example, 저는 결혼한 게 좋지만 한편으로 결혼 전 생활도 그리워요. I like being married, but, on the other hand, I also miss my life before I got married. 일을 해서 돈을 버는 게 좋지만 한편으로 자유 시간이 없어서 일을 하고 싶지 않아요.
Working and earning money is good, but, on the other hand, I don't want to work because I don't have any free time. 한명한 한 명에게 편지를 쓰다 보니 함께 쌓아온 추억이 생각나면서 기분이 좋아졌다. 한편으로는 친구들을 다시 볼수 없다는 생각에 나는 마음이 아팠다. While writing letters to each of my friends, I realized thought about all of the memories that piled up with those friends, so I was very happy. On the other hand, the thought of not being able to see those friends again made me upset. 반면 On the other hand, notes 반면에 is usually described by a preceding clause and placed as the noun in 는것 The following clause describes the opposite of the first clause, for example. 많은 젊은 사람들이 피자를 좋아하는 반면에 나이가 드신 분들은 피자를 싫어해요. Many young people like pizza, but on the other hand, older people don't like pizza. 서울에는 많은 문화 생활을 즐길 수 있는 시설이 많은 반면에 서쪽 지역에는 문화 생활을 즐길 수 있는 시설이 거의 없어요. In Seoul, there are many facilities in place for people to enjoy a cultured life, but on the other hand, in the western areas there are barely any of those things. Verbs. 점프하다. To jump. Notes. The Korean word for jump is. 도약하다. But these days people more commonly use the English derived. 점프하다. Common usages. 점프슈. Jump shot. In basketball. Examples. 공을 던지면 점프하세요. When I throw the ball, jump. 깜빡하다. To forget. Notes. 깜빡하다. Is also possible. Saying. 깜빡하다. Makes the meaning a little bit more intense. To forget in English can be expressed using different words in Korean. To indicate that one doesn't remember some piece of information or something happening. 기억 안 나다. Or. 까먹다. Can be used. 그 학생의 이름이 기억 안 나요. I don't remember that student's name. 그 학생의 이름을 까먹었어요. I don't remember that student's name. 깜빡하다. Or. 깜빡하다. Is usually used to indicate that one forgot to do an action that should have been completed. And now realizes that he she forgot to do it. For example, 문을 잠가야 되었는데 깜빡했어요. I was supposed to lock the door, but I forgot. 아침에 엄마가 사준 도시락을 깜빡하고 안 가져왔어요. I forgot to bring the lunch box that my mom packed for me in the morning. 오늘이 무슨 날인지 깜빡해서 선물을 안 준비했어요. I forgot what today is, what day it is today, so I didn't prepare a present. 빨다. To suck. Examples. 아기가 손가락을 계속 빨아서 지금 손가락이 끈적거려요. The baby kept sucking his fingers, so now they are sticky. 어린 아기들은 보통 엄지 손가락을 자주 빨아요. Young babies usually suck on their thumbs often. 어미 젖을 빨고 있는 아기 강아지가 너무 귀여워요. The baby puppy sucking on the breast of its mother is so cute. 뜨다. To open one's eyes. Notes. 뜨다. Actually has many meanings. If it is not used to refer to opening one's eyes, it is usually used to indicate that something is raised, lifted or floating. For example, 비행기가 뜨다. For an airplane to take off. 해가 뜨다. For the sun to rise. Common usages. 눈을 뜨다. To open one's eyes. 새로운 세계에 눈을 뜨다. Open one's eyes to new ideas thinking world. To not know about something. And then for something to make you realize a new way of thinking. Examples. 그 남자는 눈을 뜬 채로 죽었다. That man died with his eyes open. 저는 프랑스에 유학을 가서 예술 세계에 눈을 떴어요. I studied abroad in France and my eyes were open to the art world. 아침에 눈을 뜨자마자 저는 꼭 커피를 마셔야 해요. As soon as I wake up in the morning, as soon as my eyes open, I need to have coffee right away. 감다. To close one's eyes, the pronunciation of this word is closer to. 감다. Common usages. 눈을 감다. To close one's eyes. Examples. 눈을 감고 음악을 들으면 잠이 잘 들어요. When I close my eyes and listen to music, I fall asleep. Well. 제가 자장가를 부르면 우리 아기는 바로 눈을 감았어요. When I sing a lullaby, our baby immediately closes his eyes. 다투다. To fight verbally. Common usages. 
말다툼 An argument. Notes. 다투다 Is generally used in two ways. One is to indicate that one argues with somebody. 저와 제 남자친구는 사소한 문제로 자주 다투어요. My boyfriend and I often argue over minor problems. 제가 세상에서 제일 싫어하는 것은 말다툼을 하는 거예요. The thing I hate the most in the world is arguing with people. 우리가 어제 다투어서 저는 그랑 얘기하고 싶지 않아요. I don't want to talk with him because I argued with him yesterday. The other common way is to indicate that one competes in a competition. For example, 이 대회에서는 많은 고등학생들이 수학 실력을 다투고 있어요. In this competition, many high school students are competing with their math skills. 그 선수 두 명은 경주마다 선두를 다투어요. Those two athletes competitors compete for first place in every race. 겨루다 To compete, to fight, to vie for. Notes. 겨루다 Is very similar to. 다투다 But it wouldn't be used to indicate an argument, just a competition, much like the second usage of. 다투다 Above. Common usages. 승부를 겨루다 To compete for victory. 실력을 겨루다 To compete one's abilities. This doesn't sound natural in English, but. 실력 is put in these types of sentences. Instead of just saying those two people are competing, they would say those two people are competing their skills. 그두 팀은 다음 주에 우승을 겨룰 거예요. Those two teams will compete for the championship next week. 올림픽에서는 각 나라의 선수들이 실력을 겨루기 위해 모여요. In the Olympics, athletes from each country gather to compete their skills. 정정당당하게 실력을 겨루는 것이 스포츠에서 가장 중요한 덕목이에요. Competing fairly, fair and squarely, is the most important virtue in sports. 개설하다 To establish, to open, common usages. 수업을 개설하다 To open up start a class. 강좌를 개설하다 To open up start a lecture. Examples 이번 학기에 우리 대학교는 새로운 수업을 많이 개설했어요. This semester, our school opened up many new classes courses. 새로 개설한 수업들은 보통 기존의 수업들보다 인기기 많아요. Newly established courses are usually more popular than basic courses. Person 1. 우리 학교가 영어 회화 수업이 없어요. Our school doesn't have an English conversation class. Person 2. 네, 없어요. 그래서 제가 다음 학기부터 개설할 거예요. Right, there isn't any. That's why I'm going to start one starting from next semester. 설레다. For one's heart to be beating fast in excitement. Notes. It is common to also see here. 설레이다. Used. Officially. 설레다. Is the correct word. The word is generally used to indicate that one is excited. Common usages. 가슴이 설레다. For one's heart to be beating fast in excitement. 마음이 설레다. For one's heart mind to be beating fast in excitement. Examples. 너의 눈을 응시할 때 가슴이 설레어. When I gaze into your eyes, my heart flutters. 그 연예인의 사인을 받았을 때 너무 설레었어요. When I got that celebrity signature, I was really excited. 오늘은 남자친구와 데이트가 있어서 마음에 설레어요. I'm excited because I have a date with my boyfriend today. 제가 제 남편을 처음 만났을 때 너무 잘생겨서 가슴이 설렜어요. When I first met my husband, I was excited. My heart was beating fast because he is was very handsome. 미래에 나는 사육사가 될 것이다. 그래서 항상 동물들과 함께 있을 것이다. 그 생각만으로 나는 가슴이 설레었다. In the future, I am going to be a zookeeper. That way therefore, I can always be with animals. Just thinking about that made me excited. Passive verbs. 떠지다. To have one's eyes open. Common usages. 눈이 떠지다. For one's eyes to be opened. Examples. 저는 매일 아침 7시에 눈이 떠져요. My eyes open. I wake up. Every day at 7 o'clock in the morning. 아침에 중요한 회의가 있어서 눈이 자동으로 떠졌어요. I had an important meeting this morning. So my eyes opened automatically. I woke up automatically in the morning. 감기다. To have one's eyes closed. Common usages. 눈이 감기다. For one's eyes to be open. Examples. 
오늘 너무 피곤해서 눈이 자꾸 감겨요. My eyes keep shutting because I'm so tired. 우리 엄마는 심심한 되면 눈이 감기기 시작해요. At only 10 o'clock, my mom's eyes start to close. 할아버지는 눈이 감기기 시작하시면서 잠에 들었어요. Our grandfather fell asleep as his eyes started to close. Adverbs and other words. 왜냐하면 equal because. Notes. 왜냐하면. Is actually a contraction of. 왜 그러냐 하면. Which uses. 으면. If introduced in lesson 43, an. 냐. A way to make a quoted sentence, introduced in lesson 53. The whole construction roughly translates to something like if you ask why it is like that. In English, this can be said as because, which can connect two clauses to indicate a cause or reason. In Korean it is more common to connect sentences using the grammatical principle. 아, 어서. For example, 제가 한국을 매우 사랑해요. 왜냐하면 한국 사람들이 서로에게 매우 예의가 바르기 때문이에요. I love Korea. Because Korean people are very polite to each other. 과학을 배우는 것은 중요해. 왜냐하면 내가 살고 있는 곳을 더욱 잘 이해할 수 있게 도와주기 때문이야. It is important to learn science because it helps me understand the place environment that I live in better. 피자를 먹으면서 나는 아빠에게 계속 펭귄에 대해 말을 했다. 아빠가 내가 계속 펭귄에 대해 말하는 게 귀엽다고 생각하는 것 같았다. 왜냐하면 계속해서 나를 보면서 웃고 있었기 때문이다. While eating pizza, I kept talking to dad about penguins. Dad probably thought it was cute that I kept talking about penguins because he kept laughing smiling while looking at me. 그래서 equal there for notes. 그래서 is not actually a word, but rather 아, 어서 added to 그렇다 in lesson 23, you learned that 그렇다 Translates to like that by adding. 아, 어서. To. 그렇다. You can create. 그래서. When some situation is being talked about, you can use. 그래서. To say because of that situation. Dot. The common translation of. 그래서. Is simply therefore, or that's why. Person 1. 비가 왔어요. Did it rain? Person 2. 응, 그래서 나가기 싫어요. Yeah, that's why therefore I don't want to go out. Person 1. 우리 학교가 영어 회화 수업이 없어요. Our school doesn't have an English conversation class? Person 2. 네, 없어요. 그래서 제가 다음 학기부터 개설할 거예요. Right, there isn't any. That's why I'm going to start one starting from next semester. 한국의 주식이 쌀이에요. 그래서 밀가루보다는 쌀로 만든 음식이 더 많아요. The staple food of Korea is rice. Therefore, there are more foods made from rice than flour. 오늘은 한국의 독립기념일이에요. 그래서 전국에 많은 행사가 열릴 거예요. Today is Korea's National Independence Day. Therefore, there will be a lot of events held around the country. 내일은 토요일이잖아요. 그래서 우리가 일찍 가야 될것 같아요. You should know that tomorrow is Saturday, so we should probably go early. For more info. Please visit howtostudacorean.com.